Praxis Prepper. Hey YouTube, this is Praxis Prepper. Overnight, my channel received a thousand new subscribers, which for my channel is really huge because yesterday morning I had 2,500 subscribers and this morning there were 3,500 subscribers. So first off, welcome. Thank you very much for checking out the channel. You guys were all pretty much saying the same thing. Canadian Prepper sent us, which I think is funny because Canadian Prepper sent me also. He was my initial inspiration for starting this channel and I'm glad that he was that for me and I'm glad that he sent you guys because over the past year that I have been doing this channel I've had a lot of fun doing it, I've learned a lot, I feel like I've shared a lot of ideas with people um, but most of all, like I said, I've had a lot of fun with it. If you looked at any of the videos you know that there's, there's comedy bits in here, I try to keep it entertaining and fun because I think ultimately the whole point of surviving is so that you can live any rewarding life that might have some fun in it so why not why not represent that in these videos the other thing that you'll probably notice if you've seen any of the videos is that the comment sections are filled up with people from all different walks of life there are people from the left people from the right there are people that are more into homesteading people that are more into bugging out there are pro-trump people anti-trump people people that are kind of more in the middle like myself except maybe I'm leaning more one way than the other at this point uh, there are uh, pro-gun people people that are you know maybe more uncomfortable with firearms and things of that nature but the one thing that everyone shares is that we're all interested in preparedness and self-sufficiency and we all are uh, engaged in a civil discourse on this uh, channel and trolls just really aren't welcome here and when they do show up they don't last very long. Uh, it's great to have differences of opinion that's how we all learn and I love that. I've learned things from people that you know said in the comments you're doing that all wrong <laughs> and and I, I really appreciate that and the other commenters certainly appreciate that when they when they are able to learn something uh, new from new people uh, but it's always done in a way that you know is if you were talking to a person in real life uh, you know just being courteous respectful and and trying to actually get something accomplished by communicating something with someone so welcome to all the new people I hope you enjoy what you find here and that's what I wanted to talk about today even before I knew the Canadian prepper was going to you know do that awesome shout out is I want to talk about the new alien invasion series it starts in just a couple weeks on December 1st and uh, well actually before I, I mention that I want to say thank you to two people Will Ramsey and Alicia Elliott thank you very much for your patreon support you and so many other people are helping to make this alien invasion series even possible so thank you very much for your support there uh, so yes today I want to talk about uh, a little bit about what's coming up uh, uh, you know, in this series, uh, I'm going to give you a little uh, tidbit, the sneak peek uh, of a scene from the series. Uh, but before that, if you're not familiar with uh, this, you know, what the hell I'm even talking about? What is? It? Is there an alien invasion happening? Uh, it, it, it's a uh, narrative fiction piece that I'm doing that's going to have prepping lessons uh, embedded right into it. Here's the trailer. After the trailer, uh, I, I'll talk a little bit more about it and give you that sneak peek. This is the emergency broadcast system. This is not a test. Unidentified aircraft have been confirmed in the skies over Los Angeles, Los Alamos, New York, Boston, and other locations. The origin of these aircraft is suspected to be extraterrestrial. The intention of these beings is unknown. Extreme caution is advised. This is not a test. Right, so alien invasion is about a fictitious alien invasion, but it's really about prepping and what it's like for a prepper who's living through a collapsed environment. Uh, I'll just for full disclosure, I'm not myself actively preparing for an alien invasion. I, now, now, aliens airdropping bird flu infected clown zombies, let's go to the clip. <laughs> Yeah, that is something that we really need to keep our eye on. That's highly likely, and I think we should all prepare for that. Uh, if you watch my channel for a while, get ready to see that clip a lot. That it gets used a few times. <laughs> um, so what I'm saying is, uh, these, these things are not really about alien invasion. They're about uh, you know any kind of a collapse environment. What we can learn from that, and the aliens are there for fun and entertainment value. Uh, and it's all going to be just from my perspective. It's because uh, that's the way any one person experiences a, a collapse or a crisis is from their own perspective. If you're stuck in your house during a hurricane, you can't mentally cut to the president and know what the president of the United States is doing or anything like that. I mean, that's the way a lot of Hollywood movies are, is they cut all over the world. But this is just from one person's perspective perceiving that. Now, that said, I am working on, and I think we're going to be able to pull it off, uh, having some uh, guest appearances by other prominent 
uh, prepping channel hosts, uh, many of which I'm sure you'll be familiar with. I'm really excited about that. I think that's going to be fun. I have an interesting way of kind of connecting with those people. Okay, it's not in. I, I'm, 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 yeah, no, I'm going to keep it a secret. I almost said I'm going to keep it a secret, though. But we are going to be connecting with those other people, and and I think that will add a uh, an element of uh, fun and excitement to it. So without any further blabbing, that's another thing on my channel. I'm sorry. I. I'm verbose, and sometimes I talk a lot, so I'm sorry about that. If you Down the corner, you can uh, click on that 1.5 speed, and I think I am still understandable at that if you want to you know, just get through. But uh, yeah, I'm done for now, and here is the uh, little snippet. Uh, this is a couple uh, episodes in. Uh, my character has been following an alien ship through the woods, and we'll see what's un what unfolds. Thanks for watching. But uh, maybe I shouldn't be out in the open here. I don't know. Am I whispering too? <laughs> so they can hear me? Yeah, don't talk too loud, they'll hear you. Or maybe they can, I don't know. That's the thing, I don't know anything. Uh, I got the, the batteries charging for the radio. So, uh, maybe I'll find something out. Oh, 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 hey, something's happening. Something's happening. There's something coming out of it, or something. What is that? There's something flying out of it, something little. I don't know. I wonder if they're gonna come back this way. I think I'm going to go back in. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video.